My name is Shunsuke Hoshino. Other than the fact that I enjoy weightlifting, I'm just an ordinary high schooler with no other special traits. Just like usual, I went straight home after school. Alright, I'm going to go home and work out as usual. Huh? Is that Miyata-san? I wonder what she's doing. I saw Amano Miyata-san, my classmate, sitting down near the river in her uniform. I wonder if she needs help. Maybe I should talk to her. I can't find it. Where did it go? What should I do? It's an important gift that my older sister gave me. Miyata-san? What's wrong? What? Hoshino-kun? Oh, it's nothing. If it really was nothing, then you wouldn't be in the river when it's so cold, right? Did you lose something? Don't worry about it, really. I'll look for it myself. It's so cold! What are you doing, Hoshino-kun? What do you mean? I just thought I'd help you look. You seem to be really worried. I I'm really okay. I can just look for it myself. But it's easier to look with two people, right? Plus, I lift, so I won't get a cold with just this. Hoshino-kun. After convincing her, we started looking together. Apparently, Miyata-san dropped her earring. Did you find anything? Nope. It's nowhere. Hoshino-kun, thank you so much. I feel bad. So I'll look for it on my own from now. No, let me help you until you find it. Hoshino-kun, you're a really nice guy. Ouch! Huh? Is this maybe... Miyata-san? Is this what you were looking for? Huh? It's that! Thank God I got it back! It is? <laughs> I'm glad. It was stuck behind a rock so it didn't drift away. Thank you, Hoshino-kun. My older sister gave me this, so it's really important to me. I'm so happy that you found it. Miyata-san looked so relieved. It must have been really important to her. Don't worry about it. I'm just glad you found... <laughs> uh, are you okay? <laughs> I'm okay. I just sneezed a little. You were in the water the entire time. Yeah, I'll get home quickly and warm myself up. Make sure you don't get sick too, Miyata-san. Yeah, uh, um, do you want to come over to my house? What? I'm okay. No, come to my place. If I let you go home like this, you'll get sick. Uh, really? You don't need to worry. Nope. I can't let you get sick because of me. My house is close by. Please? In the end, Miyata-san forced me into her house. I never would have thought that I'd be taking a shower at a girl's house. If one of her family members sees me, they might get the wrong idea. I finished showering so I could say thanks and head home quickly. What? What? Uh, um... Uh, I'm Miyata-san's classmate and I... Classmate? Uh, uh, I'm sorry about that. I'll leave. Wait a minute. What should I do? She probably misunderstood things. What happened? I heard voices. Sorry, I think it was your sister. We just met in the bathroom. Hoshino-kun? You were with my sister in the... Nothing like that. I accidentally saw her. Yeah, you're right. I know you're not that kind of guy. I was going to explain what happened, but she ran away and... She got the wrong idea. Okay, I'll explain it to her. Yes, please. I'm sure it'll be fine. Don't worry about it. And like that, I left her sister up to her and went home. Hey, big sis. I wanted to talk to you about earlier. Uh, what's wrong? <gasps> oh, sorry. Can I come in? I know. When did you come in? Uh, just now. Anyways, are you okay? Your face is red. I just thought that the guy earlier was handsome. What? Of course his face was too. But his muscles! He looks like a strong guy! Plus, he seemed like a really kind person. I just keep thinking things like that. What? Hey, Ayano, can you tell me about that boy earlier? Uh, Hoshino-kun? His name's Hoshino-kun? I haven't been able to stop thinking about him. I think this is what they call love at first sight. Y you're kidding me! My sister fell in love with him in that one moment? I get that he has a strong and manly body and looks dependable. Tell me about the kind of food he likes, and what kind of person he is. Oh, and if he has a girlfriend, too! After that, my sister asked me for all kinds of information about Hoshino-kun. <sighs> a lot happened yesterday. I wonder if Miyata-san was able to explain things properly. If I have a chance, I should apologize, too. Huh?
There's something inside my shoebox. Is this... a letter? Please meet me behind the school during our lunch break. Is this what I think it is? Yeah, I think so. Whoa. It's my first time getting a love letter. Who's it from? Doesn't say. Who could this be? I was panicked from the unexpected events. During the lunch break, I quickly went behind the school. It's finally lunch. I couldn't focus during class because I kept thinking about that letter. I wonder who sent it to me. Uh, what? Is that... the girl I met yesterday? Miyata-san's sister? What should I do? I thought it was a love letter, but maybe she has something to say to me about yesterday. Um... Sorry for making you wait. Oh, you came. Yes, um... Is this about yesterday? Yep, it is. There was something I really wanted to tell you. Uh... It is. She wants to talk to me about something. She's probably mad at me. I showed her something inappropriate. I, I need to apologize. Shonsuke kun really came. I surprised him yesterday, but he forgives me. He really is a nice person. I have to be brave and tell him how I feel. I'm so sorry about yesterday. I like you. Please be in a relationship with me. I didn't. What? Huh? Um, aren't you angry about yesterday? N nope. Of course I'm not angry. It was my fault anyways. And you know, since we were able to meet, I was able to discover my feelings. Y your feelings? Yup. The moment we met, I knew. You were the soulmate I was looking for from the moment I met you, Hoshino-kun. I realized that I liked you from the moment I met you yesterday. You're different from the other guys. That's the first time I've ever felt this way. So, yeah, I really want to be in a relationship with you. What? With everything that happened yesterday, how does it lead to this? Maybe it's a prank, b b but there's no reason to do that, and she doesn't seem like she's lying. Um, you actually like me? Yeah. It's not a joke or a prank? Of course it's not. I know you're a little surprised because it's so sudden. Yeah, of course. I'm honestly really surprised. You have every right to be. I mean, it's our first time actually talking. You don't need to give me an answer right away. Huh? In exchange, will you go on a date with me next weekend? I want you to learn more about me then. A, d a date? You don't want to? Do you already dislike me so much you wouldn't even want to go on a date with me? No, 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 it's not that. Uh, okay, next weekend then. Really? Yay! And just like that, for some reason, it was decided that I would go on a date with Miyata-san's sister. Hey, Miyata-san, can I talk to you for a second? Oh, good timing. I wanted to talk to you. It's about my sister, but... Yeah, I wanted to talk about that, too. Huh? Actually, your sister confessed her feelings for me. What? Sh she told you already? Already? Miyata-san, you knew about it? Yeah, she was asking me for advice yesterday. She said that she liked you. That means the whole thing was real. Uh, and so, did you accept? No, it's kind of on hold. Are you going to turn her down? I can't believe you! What? What should I do then? Anyways, we're going to hang out on Sunday, so I thought I should let you know. Oh, well, I don't have the right to decide my sister's relationship, so... But I'll tell you one thing. I won't forgive you if you hurt her. <laughs> uh, of course I don't intend to do that! I'm believing in you, Hoshino-kun. Have fun in your date, I guess. Miyata-san must really love her sister. And on Sunday? Sorry about the wait. It's okay. I wasn't waiting that long. Thank you for coming today. Of course. Thank you too, Miyata-san's sister. It must be because she was older than me, but she looked very adult-like. Looking at her again, she's really beautiful. Yep, so I have a request before our date. A request? Do you think you can call me by my name? What? Your name? We sound like we're strangers if you keep calling me Miyata-san's sister. And if you call me by my last name, it'll be the same as Ayano-chan. Plus, I want you to call me Reno. Uh, okay. So, I'll call you Reno-san. <laughs> Thank you. Should we go then? Uh, yes. It's my first time holding hands with a girl. Whoa. I'm so nervous. I wonder if my hands are sweating. After that, 
I enjoyed my date with Rino-san. We walked around town and went shopping. At first I was all nerves, but as we started talking, I got comfortable with the fact that we were on a date. And before I knew it, I was having a lot of fun. At the same time, I slowly started falling for Rino-san. She confessed her feelings for me. She told me that she wanted a relationship. Of course, those things started turning the wheels. But I also liked that I could have fun with her. I started falling for her after watching her playful smile. Sorry, I'm going to step away for a bit. Okay, I'll wait here. Phew, that was really fun. Shunsuke-kun seemed like he was having fun too. I'm so happy. Hey, miss. You're so pretty. What? Miss, are you alone? If you have time, want to go out for lunch? My treat. No, thank you. I'm just waiting for someone. Then just until you meet up with them? Come on! Uh, um, I really can't. He should be back soon. Come on, just a little bit. Excuse me, do you need something? Huh? Who are you? I'm with her today. Anyways, did you need anything? You're so annoying. I'm asking her to hang out with me, so you should just shut your mouth and stand around- If you need anything, you can ask me. Uh, so? Tch, fine, I'll leave. Ugh. I'm glad he left right away. Sh shunsuke kun are you okay? Yeah, are you, Rino-san? Did he do something? I'm fine because you protected me. Thank you! Of course, I'm glad nothing happened. shunsuke kun you're so nice. And what you did there was really cool. What? Did you say something? Yeah, I said you're dependable and cool. Dependable? Y you think so? Yeah. Random guys always talk to me just like today. I decline politely, and if they don't leave, I just run away. But every time, I get so scared. I wonder if that's why. But I want to date someone dependable who can protect me. I think that's why I fell in love with you at first sight, too. You have a strong body and seemed really kind. You were just different from all those guys that have tried to talk to me. And being with you today, I still think that you're my ideal boyfriend. That's why I want to ask you again. Shunsuke-kun, I like you. Will you please be with me from now on and protect me? Rino-san, of course. I'd like to be your boyfriend, too. Huh? Really? Yeah, I was thinking the same thing that you were. How being around you was fun, and that I wanted to be with you more in the future. That's why. I like you, too. If you're okay with it, I'd like to be in a relationship with you. Rino-san? I'm so happy you said yes. I know we just met, but my feelings for you are so real and I won't lose to anyone else. Please take care of me. That's how Rino-san and I made it official. So yeah, we're dating now. What? I knew that she confessed her feelings so I was prepared, but... I'm still upset that you're going to steal her away from me like this. I'm sorry, but don't worry. Just like I promised, I won't hurt her or make her sad. Duh! <sighs> but I guess it's okay if it's you. What? Do you remember how you helped me look for my earring? That's when I thought, man, you're really a kind person. So it's okay if it's you. And that's why I trust you at least a little bit. A little? But you better keep your promise. If you hurt my sister, I won't forgive you. Of course! Don't worry, Miyata-san. And just like that, I was able to get Miyata-san's blessing. And... Hey, Shunsuke-kun! I was waiting for you! Sorry about that! It's fine! Let's go! Rino-san and I lived happy days as a couple. Thinking back, our first meeting was a little embarrassing. But I'm so happy and feel so blessed right now. I'm so glad that I'm able to have Rino-san in my life. <laughs>